Hey guys, welcome back to another F123 video. My team Karimo did it. I have not done my team for a while now. First time I've done it in a... Jesus. First time I've done it for a little while now. It is season 2. We've already got all them done. We've already done car stuff for, our, for the race, I think. We got one point. We got Logan Sargent as our teammate, guys. Remember, we took him from Williams. The grid order looks like that. Everything's still the same. Kevin Magnussen being in uh, Aston Martin. We'll get back to this, okay? We're clearly gonna see it in the email. So yeah, let's get into it. Are we I know we were expecting some new developments to come through. Are you serious? Some of them have failed quality control. We'll need to tell the team what to redevelop via the R and D screen. Oh well we ain't getting that in the race now. Morning. We did a whole bunch. It looks like a department has just completed a facility upgrade. Okay. Details have been sent to your inbox. So we're not getting that in for Bahrain, we're getting that in for after Bahrain. I mean, it would have been nice. So, Mercedes, so every team basically gone downhill, including our team. So, yeah. We're probably we're facing more towards the back of the grid now. But I'm used to it. Let down. Hey, welcome to the start of the new season. So, I'll be straight. We've not done as well as we should have at maintaining performance through the next change. So, we're going to be playing catch up a bit. That's going to put some pressure on you, but the whole team's behind you. Oh, good. See, I would do one of these cooler finds, but it's just where... Mm. Where it's so compact in one video, we had to do one shot. You're not bothered about them. We don't need to see all this stuff. Honestly, this will show where the car really is. There's the car, it's P19 already. We could try doing some catch up, but that's long.
I had a block out of the sun. Yeah, Fuck no, I should have brought some. Oh, yeah, we're doing tank catch up. Finished. It's time to remind ourselves once again of our top three: Leclerc, oh, yeah, we'll the back. and George Russell. With qualifying wrapped up now, we have our grid line up for the big race tomorrow. I don't even want to talk about it. The thing is, playing catch-up isn't fun. So we haven't done as well as we thought we were going to do with the regulation changes. Bear in mind, we should have done. But you know what they say. So yeah, there's no room for the race, so let's go. testing no more practice this is the real deal and it's make or break here at round one of this year's formula one world championship there's no shortage of passing opportunities around the 3.36 miles of the bahrain international circuit with the best of course at turn one and then another soon after into turn four 15 corners here, 6 to the left and 9 to the right, and we could see one or two flat spots into that tight left-hander of turn 10. So with the race not far away from starting, here's what today's grid rundown looks like. Charles Leclerc lines up on pole position, edging out Sergio Perez, who lines up P2. Looking at the rest of today's grid, we have Russell, Sainz, Hamilton, Norris, Verstappen, Stroll, Ocon, Gasly, Oscar Piastri, Magnussen, Albon, Sonoda, Hulkenberg, Bottas, Joe, Theo Porcher, De Vries, Liam Lawson, Joker, and Logan Sargent. It's almost time for those five red lights to go out then. Let's see who can prevail today. A new season then, a clean slate where anything could happen. Anthony Davidson is with me today as once again we get another year of Formula One underway. We're into those tense few minutes before the first race then. Everyone's a little bit nervous about reliability. They haven't been running in the hot, turbulent wake of other cars in practice. And they've not been pushing at 100% for long durations. Let's hope no one has to deal with any nasty surprises. Mm. Yeah. So we're gonna go for the soft to medium, just because it's the better idea. And let's go. The 
formation lap gets underway and every driver will be looking to settle in for the race ahead making sure that their car is ready for the battle once the lights go out as the cars come back towards the grid to line up for the start of the race each driver will be wanting to get the best start they possibly can and they'll be hoping to finish today's race on the podium, failing that within the points. Sorry guys, that my keyboard is in. And it's five less and away we go for the Browing Grand Prix. Oh, cause Alonso oh my god. Alonso retired, I forgot about that. That's why Mag Magnuson's in the um Aston. So I guess they've seen potential in him. at the start of the race car guys because it was a pretty good start for us yes. and Hamilton clearly so yeah Hamilton goes around the outside and we're going down the outside so yeah so Hamilton's leading into turn one turn two turn three maybe and we're going around the outside of everyone else so to get us to, to P17 so yeah We managed to get him because he kind of squeezed us and it wasn't... Ooh! Front wing damage now, fuck's sake. Vehicle condition. Okay, be careful with the front wing, you've taken some minor damage. No need to worry about the tyre condition for now, everything's looking good. We're going to get them to repair it when we go in the pit stop. We ain't got much to lose anyway, and we're losing a lot. We're losing some down boss. All right, let's focus now for the rest of the race. Okay, yeah, they may have got a little. They, we've got a second gap between Bottas and that. Do something in P1. Hamilton's in P1? I'm sorry. Interesting. No pit stops on lap one yet. Teammate status. Gap to your teammate behind is 3.3 seconds. They're on fresh softs. They're currently 21st. Time last lap was a 148.7. Nick DeVries is in last. We somehow, we somehow catch Gasly with damaged front wing. overtake button more it's time to utilize some of this energy come on so yeah them two behind us uh, keep they keep squabbling yeah squabbling so we're just gonna keep pulling a second we'll keep doing a pretty, we're gonna put a big enough gap just to keep getting away from them if you think you can get past make use of the overtake button and see what you can do I forgot we had the overtake man, not gonna lie. DRS 
DRS is being enabled this lap. We can use DRS when you're within one second of the car ahead and in the DRS zone. I'm going to try to see what we can do. These, these two are holding us up a little bit, but what do I expect? Death by him. Magnuson is putting a gap on us. We don't really matter about Magnuson at the moment. We are in uh, Alpine and McLaren sandwich at the moment. The thing is, where like DRS is so efficient down the streets. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by five point five seconds. Quite a clean overtake, to be honest. Done that nearly again. Flag. Red, maybe it looks like a Red Bull. Not behind us. Okay, safety car deployed. Safety car's been deployed. Watch your Delta. Make sure you keep it positive as we catch the pack. What happened? No. Who's that? Is that Yuki? Yuki Sonoda spun. Are you serious? You know what? We could box. We'll see what Mark says. Set hard ties. We don't have the data for that, I'm afraid. Box. Understood. Stopping this lap. We can take we're taking advantage of the safety car. Because... My teammates are not in. But we can make, we're, we're taking advantage of the safety car. To get the front wing replaced. Along with... Well, the front wing needed replaced in any way. So we're getting that replaced. Hopefully they've got a new one out. Please say that is. Please say that is. Please say that is. Please say that is. Yes, it is. We're going to be last anyway, but I don't really care. But, we're going to get out. We're going to be, our car's going to be fine. We're on hard tyres, that's the issue though. Perez is 15th. Perez is 15th. Perez box. Now. We want to finish the race on this compound. Well, my hard work's been done done, but you know. Vehicle condition. Vehicle condition. Tire condition still looking good. Tire condition are cold. Yeah, 
It could have been a no stop if there was a red flag, but there was no red flag. Now it's either up to Yuki to box to get the rid of his second five second time penalty or just stay out. We could box again and set mediums. They should really last the end of the race. Set mediums. Set medium tyres. Affirmative, medium tyres at the next stop. Box this lap. Okay, we can take you this lap. I'm not so I don't feel comfortable. Comfortable? Yeah, with these tyres. More cars. No, nope, never mind. Describe the boxing. Logan stayed out. The Reese is also stayed out. So yeah, Hamilton Russell 1-2, Verstappen's 4th, Perez is 10th, Periastri is 8th, Gasly's 7th, that's where we was fighting a minute ago but you don't really matter. So we've got Leclerc behind us. I suspect most of the front has I'm um, Albans in fifth. Jesus. Oh, um, okay, they're all peeling into the pit lane, so we're gonna be up going up places. Do not tell me that was me going in. Nope, Sergeant went in. So guys, we're now <laughs> my um we're third we're third in the race so yeah oh one keyboard but we won't probably stay third for long anyway so yeah Unless we can do some awesome def we're on hard tyres, so... Yeah, let's check what tyres everyone else has got on. Hards, we're all, they're, all, they're all on mediums, but once you get the hard tyres and fired up, it should be good. And if we get a podium on our first race of Season 2, we're there, somehow. <coughs> Cause Ru but Russell's still got to come in. Paris still has... I think, I don't know. No, Russell still has to come in. Russell's got Russell's gonna come in, so we're gonna be second. Russell's gonna box now and it's gonna be a mistake he's making. Because he's gonna get passed by everyone. But you know what? That's him, not me. I'd wait to do it. I'd wait for another safety car or something. Okay, let's get ready to go racing again. The safety car is in this lap. When the field accelerates, remember, there's no overtaking until the timing line. Safety car in this lap. Tuja. You know, green flag racing again. Okay, clear. We're going to shoot down the inside of Perez, I don't care. Whew. Get your move, but I don't care. Look where we are now. P1. P1. Ah! Ah! We're fine, guys. We're fine, honestly. Only 12 laps to hold these guys. 13 laps to hold these guys off. Even when they get the RS, we're slow. We're fucked.
battery charge is high, let's use that overtake button a bit more. We're already half a second up on Perez, now nearly a second. We're a second up on Leclerc. Teammate status. Gap to your teammate behind is 6.5 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. They're in 18th. For the time last lap was a 2.12.6. Perez is hanging on to it like, my, like the rear of my car. When they've got such good down for speed, straight line speed, and we got like back, we got corn, we got good in the corners to be honest, I think. Like the safety car helped us secure our podium nearly, I think, if we can stay in P1. Especially just being, would, this would be our second race, this would be a second race win. We be one in Brazil in season one. So yeah. I don't know however, went over to driver transfers in um, the preparation video. But yeah, it was pretty crazy to be fair. We're still up a good. Well, we're up. We're already up a second to Perez. So, Checo actually doing good in my team career mode. Not in real life, though. Danny Rick back, but not in the game yet. I speculate he's going to be back up when we did next, like, when the other races. When they get maybe this next weekend, when he comes back to Formula One for good, again. But no one knows at this moment in time, do they? They got re they replaced Nick DeVries because he did re no one saw potential in him. But to be fair, well I saw a little bit of potential in him. It's just he wasn't given a lot enough time. DRS has been enabled. DRS is now enabled. Yeah. Teammate status. We'll make the changes to the front wing next time you're in. Bitch. Front wing angle to plus one. Plus one now. Teammate status. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 0.2 seconds. They're on fresh mediums. They're in 18th. Your last lap time was a 1 minute 38.6. Actually, never mind. I changed my mind. I feel so much comfortable in these sort of hards. Plus we've got a free second gap on the Ferrari um, miss, uh, blah, 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 blah. on a um Ferrari. And a 2.5 second gap on a Michael Ferrari Red Bull. So the safety car has basically helped to secure a podium. Now the, them two are going to fight, I can tell you that now, and so is Lando. So they might start closing the gap, but they're not going to close it on me, really, properly anyway. I thought I saw a yellow flag down in sector one, but I didn't.
I guess where they where I've you've been using my ERS to get, pull a gap to pair it's pulled I pulled enough gap and then the ERS being enabled. Unless my AI level changed, but I don't think it did. Should be remaining on 59 or 63 or something, I can't remember. Seven gaps teammate behind is 20.6 seconds. There's no room for mistakes, man. Russell's only just caught up to the back of the group. To the back of the grid. Now to see Russell get back into the points will not be good because we won't see him get back into the points. We know he won't. Also it doesn't hurt where AI lose so much time in this corners. And that's how I pulled this gap as well. They also slow down when you overtake them, so... Yeah, good for Norris to see where he is up in Season 2. Yeah, we've got a Mercedes engine in this, and we can't even change it. I'm not five, I'm five seconds up on him. Bro, this is ridiculous. Well, at least the sun ain't affecting us no more. I'm going to be honest, a safety car, if we didn't get a safety car, this wouldn't have been possible. And that's me just being truthful. So yeah. Yeah, we're going to be safety car. Yep, there they go, they're fighting now. Then Lando North is gonna get dragged into it. We're a British team and we've got a fucking American and Brit we've got an American and a British driver. British. Crazy, right?
teammate status. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 30.9 seconds. They're on old mediums. They're in 19th place. The yeah. time last lap was a 139.4. Change wing down. Moving you to front wing minus one. Moving to minus one on the front wing at your next stop. Full race update. Repeat that, I've got some interference here. Full race update. You're in first position, front of the pack. Leclerc is behind you. Okay, gap to the car behind, car behind. 6.1 seconds. They're on old mediums. Pit strategy complete. See these tires through to the end now. All right, six laps to go now. That was a little bit of wheel spin, that was nice actually. Gap to your teammate behind is 32.7 seconds. Jago on use out. What a shame for the Alfa Romeo driver. I'm really starting to not feel the wear, but feel the tire wear on this car. Car's gone because um, somehow you drive past it and it takes it already. Oh my god, we drifted the car basically. Four laps left of the race. Okay, I'm really feeling the tyre wear for fuck's sake. The car wants to spin, but I'm not letting it spin. Bro, I think we're going to have to fight Leclerc.
Three laps left. You're leading the pack. That's P1. Leclerc behind. We're leaving the car behind by 3.5 seconds. They're on old mediums. That was our last stop. No more scheduled pit stops. Let's go. Come on, just three laps to go. Three laps. Bro. Teammate status. Okay, so we're leading our teammate by 33.8 seconds. They're on old mediums. They're in 19th place. And the time last lap was a 1 minute 38.4. I don't even know where Joe Guanyu was when he retired, like what position he was. Just five laps of fuel remaining. Tires aren't overheated, it's just we nearly lost the car. Specifically the rear end. Hamilton's closing in on um, Ockham. Kevin is closing on on Max, it looks like. So, last season Hamilton won the championship, so he's now an eight times world champion. I don't know where we were in the championship, I think it was like eighth, ninth. After really picking up skills and that, and not being like stupid. Lando Norris has closed the gap on them in Perez. How many has done it with Ocon? So can we see some last lap overtake maybe? Okay mate, this is the final lap of the race. Final lap. <coughs> Right, we've got enough fuel for three more laps. I'm not going to overtake Ocon. Oh, come on, come on, Nando, you can do it. No, he can't, he's too far back. Three British people in the top ten, five there, that's good. I could have just jinxed it all though, to be fair. Oh, I'm so sore. Hey, cookie. So 
Oh, superb driving. That is the race win, my friend. Well done. Of course we're driving today, but we won't be driving today. And with that, we wrap up yet another incredible Grand Prix weekend. Tell me, Ant, how do they manage to achieve this win? Well, time management probably played quite a large role in the outcome of this one. As ever, it's not just about speed, it's all about maintaining that speed consistently over a stint, over a race distance. So being able to keep up the lap times while still being smooth on the controls and gentle on the tyres, that's really where the race was won today. Welcome then to the podium, our top three drivers. What a great effort from them today in a very difficult race. Feels good winning um, the first race of the season. And oh, the next race is Spain. So then, it's time to see how this result affects the Drivers' Championship. Joker takes over the lead of the Drivers' Championship. Let's focus on the driver of the day, Anthony Davidson. Who do you pick? I have to give it to Joker. That was a commanding performance today. Very impressive indeed. It's time to see how things are shaping up in the Constructors' Championship. The owner-driver's team moved to the top of the table. Well, what an end to another fantastic weekend of racing. Thanks to everyone who joined us, and we'll see you for the next one. So guys, yeah, we nearly made a two-stop strategy, but we did it. We've done a one. To make sure that so can, that can be saved. So yeah, good race overall. To be honest, we got P1 after a tricky start. Damage to front wing. Safety car comes out because the thingy is spinning. Yeah, yeah. We took 21. We only took 21 drivers, guys. We may have lost a tiny bit of money, but that's only because we lost the front wing. It's a front wing, man. What do you care? What do you care? Who cares? Because I don't. So next race will be Spain. The team's income is looking very so, yeah. robust right now. Oh. It's time for you to have a think about our property. Let's renew our sponsors. What areas of the operation might benefit from that money? So, guys, thanks for watching um, this. F on my team video. Thanks for watching. I'll see you.